The views and opinions expressed by the hosts do not necessarily state or reflect those of the company and its management. Furthermore, the views and opinions of the guests do not reflect those of the hosts, the show, the management, and the network.
You expired, O Jesus, but the source of life gushed forth for souls, and an ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. At the hour of at the hour of three every Wednesday three p.m. live online at the hour of three Facebook page and YouTube channel. Jesus, I trust in you. Aligayam Pasko Hindi ka naman po tapos ang Pasko, kaya kailangan dumati pa rin ako ng maligayang-maligayang Pasko sa inyong lahat. At sana naman, eh, nagkakaisa kayo sa pamilya, sa mga kaibigan, at hindi kayo nag ng weight katulad ko sa kakakain. Ang sarap kasi kumain pag Pasko, ano? So, hindi pa tayo tapos, meron pa tayong bagong taon. So, watch out, diet. So, uh, hindi bali, Once a year lang naman po. So, kailangan mag enjoy tayo. Uh, it has been two years and a half since at the hour of three has been placed on the air. But it was only last July 2022 that we became legalized. We became a sec registered under the name of at the hour of three. So, with the registration of at the hour of three with the government institutions, We became wider, we became more confident in bringing to you the devotion of the Divine Mercy through social media. Ito yun talagang ating, uh, ang ating mission no? na ilagay sa social media. Ang devotion to the Divine Mercy, uh, ang elements of the Divine Mercy, and ang other teachings of the Catholic Church na related naman dun sa devotion and Divine Mercy. So because of this, We were quite successful in bringing to you people, priests, and uh, other other institutions in uh, in trying our best to be able to relay the message of the divine mercy. Um, we are five in the board of trustees, which is namely Georgie Ilagandian, Mr. Ricky So, Ms. Lily Beth uh, Quinto, Mr. Joel Manasan, and myself, Ida Manasan. Um, behind the board of trustees at the, at the hour of three, working hard and working together to be able to bring you the best on, on the coming year. No? So, dun sa six months na nag-legalize tayo, as I said, one year and a half na tayo, pero legally, uh, we are about six months. Ang ating home station produced live stream is dalawa. Yung at the hour of 3, which is 3 o'clock every Wednesday in the afternoon. At saka yung Sinong Santo, alam mo ba, every Saturday po yun, alas 8 ng gabi, anchored by four wonderful people who committed to be able to bring us the lives and the, the, lives and the personalities of Sinos. Kasi importante din sila sa buhay na natin, especially in the Catholics. So, uh, uh, with the six months also, we were able to bring you uh, live streams. We have the healing Eucharist and the power of the Divine Mercy. Healing Eucharist for every day of God and the Divine Mercy Holy Hour is every Friday at 3 p.m. was posted to us by the Lion of Shatter Parish. We also have a cross-posting daily 
The chocolate of mercy brought to us by the founder of mercy and the divine mercy Philippine apostolate of the diocese of Imos. Alas, tres ho yan. And then at uh, on a Wednesday also prior to our program, we have a 1 p.m. cross-posted the Divine Mercy Moments from Guam by Father Joel and Sister May. So kanina ho yun. So every 1 o'clock naman sila ng Wednesday kasi yun yung um, alas tres naman sa Guam. no? So uh, then DMP, Divine Mercy Philippines, cross-posting also their various activities and programs every friday naman po yon at seven o'clock so at for the past six months we were able to collaborate and bring to you our own station produced and the p the others that are produced by at the hour of three and we intend to we intend to bring more may may problema daw ang audio ko is this better? Yeah. Okay, I hope this is better. So I will continue. Um, we in, we also have our own collaborators for the past six months. We are also being uh, aired by DYWC, Radio Bandilio, the Diocese of Dumaguete, under Father Ram. No? So... Uh, immediately after our our live stream, binibigay namin sa kanila yung ating video, and they play it in their own cable network. No, in Dumaguete City, airing in uh, Dumaguete City, Siquijor, and Bohol, and south of Cebu. And we are also being cross-posted to Kapahayagan Channel of El Shaddai. Amazing! The Lord is really working. And uh, without much effort, all this happened for the past six months. On the, la the past six months also, we created a, a project, no? Uh, this project, yung umpisa yung sa November, All Souls Day, we encourage our followers, our friends to uh, send to us the soul, the name of the departed, dearly departed, and we collaborated with two priests, two parishes, to be able to say the nine days novena mass for that our dearly departed. Uh, all this also became a huge um, benefit for both the parishes that we collaborated and at the hour of the. Our second project, uh, we launched the Misa de Gallio sponsorship, which a lot of people also um answered no and we'd like to thank you for these two projects all those who trusted us uh became a huge success the misa de gallio uh was uh being done and cross posted to our channel by the la Anunciata parish of monteng lupa actually the long basis tayong nag appear no because we had a 4 a.m misa de gallio and then repeated at seven o'clock which is the midnight mass for the All Souls Day, we collaborated with two parishes, no? the parish of uh, St. Joseph Parish of Magpetro and the Father Ron Galvan. And then the other priest or the other parish, hindi siya parish, no? but the other chapel who also prayed for your dearly departed is the Chapel of Reconciliation in Sorsogon. So again, all this because you trusted at the hour of three to be able to bring to you live uh, the Misa de Gallio and connect you to our collaborated parishes and um, our collaborated uh, friend, pa, a friend priest to be able to say the Holy Eucharist for your departed loved ones. So um, I will repeat that we were able to help the various, because of these two projects that you uh, you gave your donations and intentions. We were able to help the projects of the La Anunciata pra Parish of Monteng Lupa City. And uh, there. So our Misa de Gallio, because we, we gave it to them, so we were able to help a lot in their various projects of Father Nelson Osorio. 
the healing priest and the laan ng siya at the parish. And we were also able to help uh, St. Joseph the worker in Magpet, Cotabato. Ito, uh, there are various projects because in Magpet, we were able also to donate through the donations that you also sent to us for the uh, Eucharistic celebrations on All Souls Day. And the other recipient of our All Souls Day project is the Chapel of Reconciliation in Sorsogon. There. And along with the Divine Healer Academy also of Sorsogon. So yung Chapel of Reconciliation kasi is uh, nearby the the the, the school, Divine Healer Academy, uh, headed by another healing priest, Father Gerard Vesa. So maraming maraming salamat sa pagtitiwala nyo sa at the hour of three na tutulungan natin pare-pareho itong tatlong recipient ng ating mga donasyon. So kung wala kayo, wala yung mga dasal nyo, wala yung contributions nyo, wala yung support nyo, hindi rin natin may extend ang tulong dito sa tatlong areas na to. And we intend to do more of this. No? So, I also, before I will forget, I'd like to thank the people behind the At the Hour of Three. Hindi ko kaya ito mag-isa. So, I'd like to thank uh, Angel Ginko. Wala na siya dito. Nasa Saudi Arabia na siya. But she stayed with us for quite some time. And she helped us a lot in making posters, making sure I'm online, making sure uh, my 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 audio and my video is okay. So Angel, alam ko manonood ka nito after. Maraming salamat for everything. And now, of course, uh, the one who's taking over is uh, Jerome Heronimo. Um, he's taking it alongside with another parish job, but with the permission of the parish priest. Maraming salamat, Jerome, for uh, no, always assisting us if we go live and if we have some technical problems. I'd like also to thank our new creative artists. Sabi ko, the last time si, si Angel was the one who did everything, pero ngayon hindi na pwede. So I'd like to welcome and thank uh, what is Luis, OJ and Kishina Montesilio for assisting me in my posters and in my uh, creative uh, activities. So all that to all of you, salamat at, mara, at maligayang Pasko. I'd like to move forward kasi 2023 is just around the corner. So ano ba ang plano ng at the hour of three sa 2023? First and foremost, we will be continuing, of course, with the social media um, existence and exposure of the Divine Mercy propagation, Divine Mercy messages, and the life of St. Faustina, because this is our mission. It will not only be through the messages, but we will try to do some social work or some works of Corporal Works of Mercy. We will be uh, scheduling that, hopefully, with uh, a lot of people donating and helping us no? along the way. We would be able to extend the Corporal Works of Mercy to other places. So we uh, we hope you would be able to join us in this um, activity. And then uh, we intend to add more live streams. No? So pinag-isipan pa lang namin ito. Kung ano yung pinaka maganda na ila live stream namin. So 2023 we hope to get three uh, maximum kasi hindi rin biro maglagay ng live stream and more cross posted programs that will be approved by our spiritual director. We intend to do face to face visit to various dioceses in the Philippines na merong divine mercy shrine or parish. So I think we will be starting with Cavite. I understand we have already a approved appointment with the spiritual director of the Diocese of Imos, Divine Mercy Paris. So hopefully by this January, ma materialize the lahat yun. And then we will be scheduling every month. Kung kaya namin dalawas isang buwan, kaya nin kung hindi at least one. Because, so that we will be able to bring to you live the various activities of the Divine Mercy nationwide. No? So face-to-face -face na ho yun. Lakas na loob namin. No? So another thing is we want to bring people to the various 
uh, sites, no? Do a virtual pilgrimage, and if in, you in, you intend also to visit uh, this pilgrimage site of the Divine Mercy and the Marian pilgrimage site, then we can arrange for you through at the help of a travel agency because we are not a travel agency but we are going to visit and we're going to encourage you to to also do your thing but again if you want the help then at the hour of three we'll be able to connect you to some of the travel agencies that we will be assigning to do these local pilgrimages for the divine mercy shrines and um uh, yeah, cross postings and the, and then we are we intend to have a divine mercy fiesta, fiesta also, which will come on April, no. So we have not really uh, planned it well, so we'll just be announcing it later. So I would like to request you to please, 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 please like, invite your friends to like, to follow, and to share our fb page and our youtube channel subscribe our youtube channel like follow and share our fb page and um before i will pray finally proceed to the video of our guests i'd like also to ask you if it's not too much because we are already being granted a star from the from Facebook, no. So if you feel that you can send us a star, uh, please do so. It's in the comment section of the Yungsa stream, my comment section. Please do so, so that uh, you would also be able to help a lot uh, in our in our uh, ministry in our mission. I apologies. <laughs> I said Jerome Gregorio. Uh, <laughs> Kinurik ata ako. Pasensya ka na, Jerome. <laughs> Kinurik gato. Natatawa tuloy siya. Anyways, Jerome, who is already at my back on the technical side. So, um, we proceed. I promised you to bring to you so many people who will be thanking all of you from all points of the Philippines. So, I will not delay. And uh, this is Aida Manasan from the At The Hour of the Greeting all of you. A Merry, Merry Christmas and a blissful 2022. Maraming salamat sa inyo lahat. Hello, this is Joel Manasan of Sidong Santo. Alam mo ba, bumabati po sa inyo ng isang pagpalang Merry Christmas. Come 2023, we hope to see you more as we discuss marami pang mga santo. May the spirits of this Advent season, hope, peace, joy, and love be with us all. This is Beth Shawson from Sinong Santo. Alam niyo ba? Bumabati sa inyo ng maligayang Pasko at masagana, mapayapa, at ligtas na bagong taon. May God bless us all. Let nothing, let nothing disturb you. Let nothing frighten you. All things are passing. He who has God lacks nothing. With patience, you can endure all things because in the end, nothing matters but God alone suffices. From the words of St. Teresa of Avila. My name is Brother John Thomas Maria of the Most Blessed Sacrament from the Missionary Servants of the Divine Mercy, wishing you a very Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year. And by the way, I'm from Sinung Santo, Alamuba. God bless you. 2022 has been a continuation of the world pandemic which started in 2020. This face mask is a symbol of that world pandemic. We covered our face, we locked our homes, we were forced to do online masses, but at the same time, we were able to spread the devotion through the social media, through Facebook, Instagram, and all other platforms over the internet. From the original intention of holding this for straight one month in September 2021, it has become a daily habit for all of us. Nagpapatuloy po itong magpahangga ngayon. 
And for that, we would like to thank each and every one those who are joining consistently via Zoom, attending the Zoom meeting every 3 a.m. And all those who are watching and participating via live Facebook and through all other pages, the Fount of Mercy at the Hour of Three, Divine Mercy Apostolate in the Diocese of Imus. And we have spread from the Diocese of Imus all over the world. We have devotees watching from the U.S., Australia, and other parts of the world. This internet has been a blessing for us despite all the difficulties we had over this pandemic. Again, thank you everyone. And as I remove this mask, may we be able to face every challenges every day from 2023 forward. Blessings of good health, peace, prosperity, higher spirituality to all of us. Maraming salamat po ulit. Daghang salamat sa tanan. Merry Christmas! Thank you po. Merry Christmas sa lahat. Maray na aga sa Induga, boss. Merry Christmas po. A Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year to all of us. Maray maray po salamat at maligayang Pasko sa lahat. Madam, madamo nga salamat. Maligayang Pasko po. Just mabalo sa Induga, boss. Maligayang Pasko po sa lahat. Maimbundag sa tanan. Merry Christmas. God bless us all. Maraming salamat po sa lahat sa Divine Mercy. Dagan kayong salamat sa inyo. This is our uh, vocation. This is our mission. Merry Christmas po sa lahat. One o'clock na dito. Merry Christmas sa lahat. Naimbaga Paskwa, Pinyayo Amin, Kadkakadwa ti Divine Mercy. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year sa lahat po ng mga devotees, kamag-anakan at kaibigan sa New York, Canada, Ireland, at sa lahat po ng mga kasapi. Uh, salamat sa plaging uh, pag-tune in dito sa alas tres ng madaling araw. God bless us. Uh, maraming salamat po sa pag bye sa 3 a.m. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to all. Greetings from the Divine Mercy Moment Show. Merry Christmas. I'm for the Joel de los Reyes. And I am May Ordonez. First of all, we would like to thank you for the hour of three. Ida and Joel Montesilio. For letting us cross post the Divine Mercy Moment Show live stream at the Hour of Three Facebook page. The Divine Mercy Moment Show is being live streamed through FB page and being broadcast live at KOLG 90.9 FM on Guam every Wednesday. And you can watch us live Manila time from 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. Also, we would like to thank all of you for watching the show every Wednesday. Your support helps increase more our motivation to propagate the divine mercy moments in the love of Christ our Lord and Savior. And you being with us during the show does not only bring joy to our hearts, but keep us going to continue to share the best way we know God's love and mercy. Thank you for passing the divine mercy moments show to others by sharing the Facebook page. Please continue sharing. May God bless you all again from the Divine Mercy Moment Show. Thank, Thank you and, and a blessed, blessed Christmas, Christmas to all. Warm greetings of a beautiful Christmas full of God's mercy and love. And a new year that is not only full of prosperity and good health, but as well as a new year which is filled with graces. I am Georgie Ilagan Bian at the R of Three. Maligayang Pasko sa lahat ng mga tagasubaybay ng programang Sinong Santo, alam mo ba? Ako po si Brother Carlo from Saskatchewan, Canada. Sana po ang buhay ng ating mga banal na santo ay magbigay aral Halimbawa, 
at inspirasyon sa lahat ng mga katolikong naguguluhan at nag-aalinlangan sa kanilang pananampalataya, lalong-lalo na sa mga nakakaranas ng matinding pagsubok sa buhay. Our many saints will give us examples on how to overcome our crisis in faith. And with their prayers and intercession, we will be brought closer to Christ and become like them, saints in our modern time. And so keep watching Sinong Santo, alam mo ba? Merry Christmas and have a blessed New Year ahead. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat sa lahat na nag-sponsor ng Mesa, lalo na po sa grupo ng The Hour of Three. Merry Christmas po and Happy New Year. Nawapi lalong maging masagana ang susunod na taon at naway ang tunay na diwa ng Pasko ang maghari sa ating mga puso. Kiligtas kayo sa anong kapahamakan at merong laman. Special thanks kay Kuya Joel and Ate Aida Man Manasan. Thank you very much po. God bless. Hope to see you po next year. God bless. Hello. Isang uh, magyayang kapaskuhan po sa inyo at uh, dumipas na yung Pasko, tayo ay medyo nakakatawa. Dama ng uh, pagod, uh, puno sa kasiyahan ng mga sim. Bang gabi, ada bunga bati po. Aku sayangyo, nang sana melusuk kau. Adi ati Aida, aku ya Joel, angkanya yang. Uh, husband uh, at uh, kapwa uh, naglilingkod para sa promotion ng Divine Mercy. Ganun din yung ating mga promotion. Motors ng Divine Mercy, isang uh, maligayang gayang Pasko uh, sa inyo. Uh, at, uh, Uh, ako po ay uh, inanyay kayahan na magsalita hinggil sa I'm Lily Beth Mia Makintos. 
a board of trustee of At the Hour of Three, greeting you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Ito ay ating paksa ang pag-asa ng pagdating ng ating Panginoong Yesus upang iligtas tayo. Bigyan tayo ng buhay na Masaghana dahil sa kanyang pagkikipiling sa atin at uh, naganap na yung araw ng Pasko at yung Emmanuel ay nasa atin at uh, Uh, tayo ay tumanggap sa kanya bilang ating tagapag ligtas ay noon po ay ang paksa ay pag-asa muli. At yun ay sa ating naharap na bagong taon, ha? Uh, 20... 23. Uh, sana tayo ay Uh, buhay pa ha? at hindi lang buhay ha? malusog ha? Eh, baka naman eh buhay nga pero, pero gumagapang ah, na, oh, pakahirap naman yun ha? pero uh, yung ating kalusugan ay ating makabit para sa paglilingkod sa ating Bayanan. Ang ating pagsamba, tumutung mo sa pagmamahal sa ating kapwa-tao. Ngayon po ay panahon ng kapaskuhan at uh, Maaring uh, wala na tayong nadidinig.
na Christmas Carol. No? E di... Yan po ay isang malaking kapulangan na Pagkatapos ng Kapaskuhan, na, tahimik na mga Christmas carols. Eh. Kailangan po ngayon pa rin ay nakikinig tayo ng mga uh, Christmas carols para madama natin itong pinaghan. Daan na, na simbang gabi. Oh, apat. Na linggo ng Adviento at uh, dumating na. ang ating uh, kaligtasan na kaya yun po ng uh, mga Christmas carol sa yating pagkain gana at yun po ay aking kinasasanayan at nalala ko po yung mga nung uh, yugto ng aking kabataan ah, sa seminaryo at ah, nung ako ay bagong pari ah, yun ay uh, Luna sa mga simbang Our sincerest apologies no something went wrong matino naman yung video when we receive it because it's a video message from Bishop Victor uh, Ocampo of the Bishop of Gumaca Quezon he is our spiritual director for at the hour of the we don't really know what happened, but siya nagputol-putol. So, since hindi siya maintindihan, we decided na lang to discontinue. And we are going to try our best to post in the page of At the Hour of Three his entire message. Please, So, please bear with us. We apologize to all of you who are watching, especially from the, the followers from the Quezon area, no? to Sister Elizabeth Quintos. Hindi ko namin malaman kung ano nangyari but hindi kasi talaga siya magandang panuorin na kasi nagputol-putol. So it i-end na lang muna namin and we will post it uh doon sa FB page. Abangan niyo na lang. Uh, we will probably be able to do it today. So as an end video, I'm, I really apologize nag ending tayo ng 2023 na hindi maganda. All the other videos came out live. I'd like to bring back to you the video of Sister Lilibet uh, from the Diocese of Gumaca. She is the one, she's the lay coordinator for the Divine Mercy Philippines. Je? Si Lilibet I'm Lilibet Niema Quintos, a board of trustee of At the Hour of Three, greeting you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you, Lilibet, again. 
uh, masama man ang video ending, we will try to really upload it on the page. And maraming maraming salamat po sa inyo. We will see you again come January 4 because we also have a beautiful guest who will talk about the souls in purgatory. So for, uh, we have to end the uh, early because we don't have any more videos to show to you. Maraming maraming salamat at uh, magkikita kita tayo come 2023. Happy New Year to everyone and Jesus, I trust in you. Mm -hmm.